टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न मोफोलॉजी ऑफ मलिग्नेंट गैस्ट्रिक अल्सर हेयर यू कैन सी ऑन द लेफ्ट साइड इज अ गैस्ट्रिक दिस इज लोअर एंड ऑफ द इसोफेगस हेयर इज द बॉडी ऑफ द स्टमक एंड दिस वन इज द एंट्रम आर द पोर्शन विच इज अटैच टू द डोलिनम हेयर इज द हिस्टोलॉजी ऑफ नॉर्मल गैस्ट्रिक म्यूकोजा इट कंसिस्ट ऑफ सफेस एपिथीलियम द पिट्स एंड म्यूकोजल ग्लैंड एंड इन बिटवीन स्ट्रोमा now usually the patient with gastric carcinoma the presenting symptoms are non specific but usually patient is of older age group and there is history of marked weight loss and abdominal pain and here you can see a specimen which show a large defect the margins are heaped up rounded and there is necrosis and hemorrhage in the center and here you see the redness and small nodularity around surrounding this defect so heaped up margins that these are rounded elevated and there is necrotic base so we can label two morphological features heaped up margins they are rounded they are they are beaded and necrotic base malignant gastric ulcer usually there is effacement of the mucosal folds mucosal folds gets flattened then usually malignant gastric ulcer occurs along the greater curvature of the stomach their margins are irregular and necrotic slough in the floor surrounding area shows nodules ulcer and irregularities and the ulcer is usually large and deep these are the features of malignant gastric ulcer and when you see uh, microscopic biopsy under microscope here you can see loss of normal architecture because there is no uh, surface epithelium there is no uh, mucosal pits and no mucosal glands as you uh, we have seen the normal architecture was like this so first identification point is loss of normal architecture then you can appreciate uh, pleomorphism there are uh, cells with high nc ratio and uh, darker uh, chromatin uh, these are the uh, cells which show uh, these are malignant cells and these are cells uh, they are signet ring cells these cells are also malignant but because presence of mucin pushed the nucleus to the one side and they appear as the ring these are called signet ring cells and you can see there are sheets of malignant cells so connect to allah you are working so hard to succeed in your studies because this link is never busy always answered no hang up no heartbreak when you are tired of reading uh, difficult subjects so connect to allah it's very easy allah sent a book Uh, which is book of uh, uh, allah named quran so when you are tired when you are frustrated read quran and connect to allah now uh, the benign gastric ulcer they are uh, also presented with abdominal pain and nausea there is shorter history and on physical examination uh, there is uh, sample stool sample is positive for occult blood and upper gi endoscopy revealed solitary 2 cm diameter shallow ulcer now we can compare the findings of the two 
Uh, here you can see there are uh, point out margins, they are clean cut, no heaping or beading. Uh, ulcer is shallow and there is clean base or there is uh, base show granulation tissue. So benign gastric ulcer, site is very important. Usually they occur in lesser curvature and mucosal folds are overhanging. Uh, their margins are regular. Uh, floor show granulation tissue and edges are not elevated, they are punched out and surrounding area is also normal because there is no malignant infiltration in the surrounding area and small or they may be deep up to muscle layer because deeper um, ulcers can cause perforation. When you see the biopsy there is uh, normal mucosa on the right side and there is ulcer as you can see the uh, orange line this is the ulcer and uh, there is granulation tissue granulation tissue means proliferation of blood vessels and fibroblast in the base so i hope you like uh, the video uh, if you like share this and subscribe to the channel